Valentine agent. The listening device is working perfectly, and Nemro can keep no more secrets from us. Imperial intelligence has determined that Nemro's human lieutenant, Carol's Jarvis, is the weak link in his operation. You're going to twist the man until he serves us. He won't be any trouble to manipulate. Unfortunately, Carol's is on the verge of disfavor with Nemro, while the Twi'lek Lieutenant Tuflijan, I believe, is Nemro's rising star. I want you to go to Carol's and offer your services as the Red Blade. Do whatever is required to bring Carol's glory in Nemro's eyes. What does Nemro have against Carol's? Carol's work has been suffering due to the interference of the Fothra clan. Nemro finds that an unacceptable excuse for failure. One other thing, Agent, this operation of ours has drawn the attention of a member of the Dark Council, Darth Jadus himself. The Council's authority is second only to that of the Emperor. It's a rare honor for an intelligence operation to be overseen in this way. We don't need the oversight of Sith to do our job. Watch what you say. We answer to the Sith whether you feel we need them or not. Report back once you've rendered whatever aid Carol's requires. Keep her out. Yes! Oh, yes! Oh, saved, of course! Nemro the Bounteous takes me from the swamp, yes? He gives me a new name, new job, he makes me Morsel, the Administrator. Nemro orders me to keep work camp and forces in line, but they hired to bully Evil Kai. They laugh at me. Just tell me who you need dead, and how much it's worth to you. Enforcers hard to hire, harder to keep, so they think they can do as they please, but we can't kill them. Go to work camp, wave your gun in Chief Enforcer's face, make him see more so no one to laugh at. And I have stack of credits for you. in such a hurry, Blade. Don't you remember me? Your old buddy, Dino Ray? Now, you haven't aged well since we met up on Hoth. Your nose. And your skin. But you couldn't be an imposter. You know your friend Dino. Of course I remember you, Dino. How long's it been? A little too long, it seems. Turns out we got a problem. You see, you don't look like the Blade I know. The Blade who owes me credits. But you say you're the Blade. So I'll take you at your word, and ask for my money. You understand? I understand, all right. You're a rat who needs to die. Is that so? Well, let's see what you can do, Blade. Blade, come on over. Glad to see you're enjoying the palace. Look, I've only got five minutes before I have to go meet with some alien freaks, and I want to ask you something. You've been around the galaxy a few times. What's it like dealing with the Empire? Mind if I ask why you want to know? You're one of the last real independents. I admire you for that, but your kind is dying out. The Huts have taken control of the gangs, and I think real soon the Republican Empire will want control of the Huts, even if Nimrod won't believe it. So, if we gotta pick a side, I wanna pick a winner, and I don't see the Empire losing. That sounds reasonable, but what are you gonna do about it? For starters, I make sure I'm not being stupid. There's more on the line than business. My sons are free traders. They're doing business in the Sullis system. It's their first time dealing with the Empire, so I worry. I probably shouldn't. 
But you came to me for a reason. What can I do for you, Blade? Where it is, you're on the outs with your boss. Is it true? Nemro's been stewing in his slime since we lost a shipment of rare ores in the Yvokai lands. He blames me for some reason. Now the Yvokai, they're Hutta natives from before the cartel came. They mostly want us dead. If you get that shipment back, I'll pay you good. How much money are we talking about? More than enough. I'm not negotiating. There's a work camp outside Jaguna. Nimro set it up for some Yvokai who wanted peace. Bad deal, poor rubes. The chief there, Odef, was supposed to talk to the other Evokai tribes about returning the ore, but he didn't come through. He knows something, though. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have an appointment to keep. But I look forward to seeing if the Red Blade's as good as they say. We're not responsible for missed departures. There are others waiting. Move along. I hear you're giving Morsel a hard time. That you don't respect Nemro's authority. What? Who you... Oh, man. 
Hey, look, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry. You know, boys, we're just having some fun. You, we didn't think you, you're not going to kill me, are you? If I have to come back out here, it will be the last time. You are not going to have to come back out here again, boss. I guarantee it. We, we won't give Morsel a hard time anymore. Won't even laugh at his name. Swear. Shoo hi, stranger. That's evil kind native speak for hello. Don't get a lot of visitors here who aren't backward savages. You uh, come to the work camp looking for laborers? That's none of your business. Right you are. I spend so much time around these evil Kai savages, I forget my manners. My name's Varsunta, by the way. I deal salvage to the evil Kai. Smelly work, but profitable. Most evil Kai are decent, though not too bright. Like my little helper here. Say hello, Imat. Welcome to Varsunta's many treasures. Do you know the Black Death who slaughters my people? Imad, I keep telling you, not every off-worlder knows the Black Death. Oh, ignore him, stranger. This isn't your problem. This Black Death, is it uh, a man or a beast? A man. Man, that's not his real name. Evo Kai call him that because he wears black when he hunts him. The Black Death kills my people for sport. Butchers women and children. He started out hunting hostile Evo Kai in the swamps, but now he's killing ones from the work camp. Having the time of his life. Keeps their ears and teeth as trophies. If this slaughter keeps up, I might have to get a real job. You know, I'll bet someone like you could convince this guy to quit. I'd sure make it worth your while. If this guy doesn't take the hint, do you want me to kill him? Hmm. Violence is bad for business. Your call, though. You're looking for a vehicle out in the swamps surrounded by security droids. This uh, Black Death guy doesn't like visitors. You'll probably want to do something about his droids before you try talking to him. Good luck! You said you were going to get the ore back. I have done all I can. They, the other tribes, will not listen. If you say so. Hey, you the Red Blade. Heard you were coming. Thought we'd soften up the chief for you. Any luck with your interrogation? Says he's real sorry he couldn't make a deal. That's about it. The other tribes. The evil Kai who refused peace, it was it was they who attacked your shipment. You have given us homes and work. I I help you willingly. But the tribes will not return Nemro's medals. They won't even negotiate. The tribes, they stole the shipment to spite the huts and to use for themselves. They will make weapons, machines. They took the metals to their great village in the swamps. Only a beast or a shadow can enter. Seek the shipment there if you wish. Feel lucky I'm letting you live, Odef. Unless I find out you've been lying. You will not. I only want peace. All right, Chief. Let's get you a med pack or two. You've had a busy day.
stop this nonsense at once. What do you think you're doing blasting my droids? I'm a senior administrator of Zerka Corporation. You could be the queen of Naboo, for all I care. Watch your tone, little boy. I'm an important man. I demand to know why you're disturbing my hunting trip. You have a sick fascination with collecting the natives' ears. I always take trophies for my kills. It's half the joy. I have Gundark ears and Rancor tusks, too. We both know Ibokai are no better than act dogs, so stop pretending this is about them. Look, I understand how things work here on Hata. I'll pay you handsomely to leave me in peace. You've got a deal. I couldn't care less about the Ivakai. You rabble. Always grasping for a few extra credits, aren't you? Here, take them. Do not disturb my holiday again. Understand?
Dr. Terab, I've come about Nemro's bounty on the advanced droid data cores. Responsible for missed departures. There are others waiting. Move along. Slow down, Blade. Stay with me a while. We haven't had the chance to talk. I'm Kaleo. Nemro puts me in charge of the good stuff. His guns, his troops, the safety of his little palace. You can spare some time for me, right? I have a minute. What can I do for you? So sweet and so polite. And here I figured you'd be eager to head back outside, blow the heads off a few locals. You've got a nasty reputation, you know. I hear you went and murdered poor Dino Ray right on this spot. What was that about, Blade? He came after me. I just defended myself. It's too bad. He had a pretty face before you messed with it. Me? I'm betting you and Dino had something else going on. You had a reason for coming to Nemro's house. Maybe money, maybe power. I like to think you'll be trouble, Blade. You'll be bloodthirsty, treacherous. Because I could enjoy keeping an eye on a bloodthirsty, treacherous pirate. I could enjoy being watched. Hmm. Maybe we'll get along after all. If you are trouble, take your time. I'd hate to stick a blaster to your head, or a slave collar around your neck, before I've seen everything you can do. That's all I wanted to say. You can go now. Watch your back, Kaleo. I'll watch yours. You can watch mine. Fathra will not stop his mining operations. He's going to keep tapping our gas pocket and cut our supply in half. Oh, Kakiza Spida Perupa. God was Shiniko Higa Danulia. Play dumb with me, Tafajin. 
Fatho doesn't need to steal our customers if he doesn't leave us any gas to sell, and we can't uproot him without help. Punyukichawa Joto Jamba. Idiot. Sorry about Tafel Jim Blade. Legitimate business brings out the worst in us. Makes me miss actual crime, you know? But it looks like you're about to brighten my day. You find the shipment? I have it right here. Delivered as promised. The fee's been transferred to your account. You'll have access by the time you're back at your apartments. You earned every credit. I'd buy you a drink in the cantina, but I need to have a chat with Nimro. We should talk more another time, though. You do good work. Always looking for business. Just say the word, Carols. Then I'll see you when I see you. The operation is proceeding well, Agent. Thanks to your intervention, Carol's Jarvis will once again have Nemro's ear. I took note of your meeting with Nemro's security chief, Kaleo. You handled yourself well. Still be on your guard. We've identified her as a freelance assassin, enforcer, and anarchist. She's been attached to a dozen employers in half as many years, using several different aliases. Killing her wouldn't be any trouble. I can lure her somewhere isolated. She's a wild card. She may prove a liability, but she could also prove very useful. Watch her. On to more immediate concerns. Nemero operates a major Schwarz gas mine on Hutter. The Empire wants access to Nemero's refined gas. Unfortunately, Fathra is tapping the same gas pocket as Nemero. We need to destroy Fathra's operations in the rust yards before Nemero's grinds to a halt. Can't we just buy the gas from Fathra instead? Nemro's refineries produce Schwarz usable as a precision explosive. Fathra can't refine the gas to the same degree, and he's wasting it by trying. He will travel to Fathra's mining facility and place explosives in the drill shaft, destroying the equipment and collapsing part of the gas pocket. You'll need to strip a uniform and credentials off the facility guards to pass the final security checkpoint. A working disguise is imperative. Should be straightforward. Your disguise may not hold up under close inspection, so avoid conversation. The explosives have already been delivered to your room. Once you're finished, go back to Carol's Jarvis and make sure he knows what happened. Take the credit if you like. It'll be handled. Is there anything else? One more thing, Agent. Darth Jadis pays increasing attention to your work. He will reward success or failure appropriately, and I will not intervene. Report back after you've destroyed the mine and inform Carols of the results. Keep her out. <laughs> 